So hey guys, in this video, I'm going to show you how to update your Windows 7 to the latest version of Windows 10 without losing data, applications and apps. I am Vikas and you're watching VFX Vikas. Before starting this video, like this video and subscribe to my channel. In this video, I'm going to use ISO file to update my Windows 7 to the latest version of Windows 10, which is 20s2. To download the ISO file, what you need to do is open up your browser, then go to google.com. Type for media, crescent tool, click on the first link www.microsoft.com, create windows 10 installation media and then click on the download tool now button. After downloading the setup, open that folder where you downloaded the file, right click on the media crescent tool, select run as administrator, then select yes. And then wait for some time to complete the process. Don't do anything in your PC if that media creation tool is opening now. If you get this error Windows 10 setup, there was a problem. What you have to do is restart your PC. That is the best way to update your Windows 7 to the new Windows 10. By using this method, you will not lose all of your data in your C drive, D drive and any another drive. After completing the process, it will look like this, application notices and license terms, click on accept. So before doing this, make sure your C drive is 8 GB free. Let me show you, as you can see my C drive is 30.06 GB free now. And then what do you want to do is upgrade this PC now, create installation media. If you have a proper internet connection, you can go with upgrade this PC now, but I will recommend you to create installation media, select this option and then click on next. Use the recommended options for this PC, check it, click on the next, choose which media to use, USB flash drive, ISO file. I will recommend you to use ISO file because this is the best method to update your windows. Click on the next and then select the location, path where you want to save it. I will select desktop and then rename this file, whatever you want, click on the save button. Downloading windows 10, feel free to keep using your PC. It depends on your PC how much this will take. Once you have done, it will look like this. Then click on finish button. After downloading this Windows 10 ISO file, you will need a software to extract your ISO file. To extract it, what you need to do is open up your browser and then go to google.com. Type winrar. Click on the first link www.winrar.com. Click on download winrar and then scroll down. Click on again download WinRAR. After downloading the WinRAR setup, open that folder. Right click on the setup, select run as administrator. Then select yes. Click on install. After installing, click on ok. Click on done. And then right click on your Windows 10 ISO file which you had downloaded from Media Creation tool. Right click on it. Select extract files. Click on ok. After extracting the file, open that folder, right click on the setup, select run as administrator. Before opening this setup, make sure your internet is disabled and your windows is activated. If you don't know how to activate your windows 7, video link in the description and also in the i button, go and watch now. And then wait for some time to complete the process. Don't do anything in your PC while this setup is opening on your PC. Install windows 10. Check on I want to help make the installation of Windows better privacy statement. Change how Windows setup download updates. Select this option and then click on next. Checking your PC. After completing the process, it will look like this, ready to install, install Windows 10, whatever version you have installed. I have installed Pro version, so it is showing me Pro. Keep personal files and app, click on change what to keep, choose what to keep, keep personal files and apps, 
If you choose first option, keep personal files and app, it will not delete anything in your PC. If you choose second option, keep personal files only, it will delete your settings and apps permanently. Third option, it will delete everything in your PC. So I will select the first option, keep personal files and apps because I don't want to lose my data in my C drive because this setting does not affect your other drives like D, E, F, G, H. Click on next and click on install. As you can see now Windows 10 is installing on my system. So now don't do anything. Windows 7 is updating to the latest version of Windows 10 which is 20 H2 version. Working on updates so don't turn off your PC. Your PC will restart many times while installing Windows. As you can see, I have successfully updated my Windows 7 to the latest version of Windows 10. This might take several minutes to complete the process. Almost there. That's it. Everything is here. After updating the window, the important thing is what you need to do is download and install driver booster. If your keyboard and mouse and anything is not working, after installing driver booster, it will work properly. To install it, open up your browser. As you can see, my Microsoft Edge is properly changed. We have updated windows to bring you a brand new browser. Type for driver booster. Click on the first link, download driver booster. Click on free download, select free download, press ctrl j to go to download. Then here is the driver booster setup. After downloading select so in folder, right click on the setup, select run as administrator. Then select yes. This software will help you to operate your system very smoothly, very fast, without lag. If your graphic card is not working after updating windows, then it will work properly. Click on install, no thank all. No thanks, uncheck learn more online scan now. Click on scan. So before scanning connect your internet connection. Hurry driver booster free has updated all updatable drivers for you. If you get any update, click on update now and then reboot your PC. So hope you guys like this video if you like my video don't forget to subscribe my channel thanks for watching and don't forget to hit the bell icon if you have any query or question comment me down below